I mean, it's crazy. We saw him at heavyweight. We saw him at light heavyweight. And look at him now. He is shredded. Presenting Jared the Killer Gorilla Cannoneer. Good corner advice. And Cannoneer, they said, hey, remember how we said he's got three good takedowns in him? That was five. So many. Those were some ruthless ground and pound shots. Welcome to the middleweight top 10, Jared oh, Cannonier. Yeah. What a spectacular middleweight debut that was. And what an opportunity to come in here, short notice to fight a guy like David Branch. You were preparing for another fight, and what a result. Thank you, Joe. Um, it feels good, especially to do it here on one of the biggest stages, one of the biggest arenas in the world. Plenty of people have come here and gained a lot of notoriety, fame, fortune, and uh, I'm just so happy to be in this position to do the same. With his confidence at an all-time high, here is the 10th-ranked middleweight contender, the killer gorilla, Jared Cannonier. Big win over David Branch. Dominic Cruz set up this opportunity against one of the best tonight. Right knee injury for Anderson Silva, Serious. courtesy of the Cannoneer kick. Jared Cannoneer came in here with a game plan to land that kick, and he landed it over and over again. I mean, that's a good inside leg kick. You don't know the extent of the injury, but you see Cannoneer throw his hip all the way into the kick, and it lands at the knee, right? Like, right at the knee is where that kick landed. That's uh, that's one of the most painful kicks you can take in all of fighting. The killer gorilla! Things seem to be aligning perfectly for Jared Cannonier. He went from heavyweight, light heavyweight, to middleweight. This is his 10th UFC fight, his first main event. He passed the test of Anderson Silva in Rio, and now he's here in Denmark. The Joker versus the Killer Gorilla. Smile on the face of Cannonier. Check that one. And it's normally the smile on the face of the Joker. Will that change? Oh, that was a good uppercut. Oh, oh, he Melanson met. looked like he's hurt here. Cannoneer's throwing it hard. Oh, quiet. Here's the ground and pound that Cannoneer talked about as well. Yeah, he's he's hurt. hurt. He said he has concussive ground and pound. Oh, oh wow. it! Wow. Jared Cannoneer gets it done! A middleweight on the rise is Jared Cannoneer. You have got a new contender for real at 185. Next, after this, uh, there was a lot of people writing me off because probably because you don't know me because I don't run my mother because I don't run my mouth but uh, I don't I don't I don't use my mouth to tell let people know how I fight you're gonna have to watch me to know how I do my thing and uh, it's gonna be better every time so the more you guys avoid me the better I'm gonna get and the harder it is gonna be gonna be to beat me eventually it's gonna be for the belt and might as well be next you know what I'm saying? To give everybody else a chance to get their hands on it before I get too good for anybody. Well, the middleweight division is definitely on, on, uh, on notice. Congratulations, my friend. That was an excellent performance. Ladies and gentlemen, Jared Cannonier.